Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. I have a fun video for you today. Kat Von D just released some lip toppers and I was super excited about one in particular because I have been wanting and looking for one forever it seems like and no brand has one in this color so they had an early release on the Sephora app so I jumped on that and ordered this bad boy before they were even released so we're gonna do a little first impressions and swatch the all the colors are very beautiful but the one I was most interested in is this one called wizard because I mean the tube is black but the lip topper slash liquid lipstick is black glittery metallic black not just matte black I have matte blacks and there's plenty of matte blacks out there but I really wanted a metallic or glittery black something with some dimension so I'm excited to try this out I'm going to just put it on my lips and we're gonna see what we get layering it so again I just opened this out of the box you are getting my true first impressions let's do this pretty it almost looks like the um, bristles are like a dark purpley red we'll see what this looks like on guys I have nothing on my lips bare barren Application is not my best work, but you get the idea. So far, I love it. This is one coat. I mean, that's pretty dark. It is a little bit transparent. So if you had a color underneath, it would show through just a tiny bit. So you could really darken up and vamp up a color you already have. Like you could put black under here, you could have red, you could have literally any color under your rainbow and you'll look good. I'm going to go in with a second coat and we're going to try to make this really stand out. I mean two coats and it's completely Okay. This is a very thin formula. It's not heavy on my lips. It does remind me texture wise of the Diamond Crusher lip toppers from Lime Crime. Okay, not my best, but you get the idea. So if I'm going to explain the texture because some of you might not have the Diamond Crusher. It's from Lime Crime. It's a very liquid and watery, a very thin formula, but I don't, like, I don't feel like it's going to drip anywhere or it's thin in a bad way. It's very easily easy to manipulate and it doesn't feel like there's this big, thick layer on top of your lips. Um, this feels really good on. It's very comfortable and it's almost dry. I kind of just thinned it out a little bit by doing that. I didn't let it dry all the way. Um, but holy crap, this is really pretty. The closest thing I have to this or that I found is um, the Black Unicorn Diamond Crusher from Lime Crime. They did just release some new colors and I think there's one called Gemini, but it looks more like a dark purple shift and not this is truly like there's all these colors in here it's like 
the the liquid part is black but all the glitter part is like a rainbow so this is really pretty this is perfect this is exactly what I wanted like this looks so good on and it's so comfortable obviously I can't speak for the longevity yet um, I just got back from work filmed another video and I'm going to bed after this guys I'm being a grandma so I am not gonna report back in this video on how the wear time is I just wanted to give you some first impressions and a first look because these are new and exciting there was like seven or eight colors in the whole collection very pretty after having this and trying it I might have to get a couple more I was trying to resist since I've got a decent amount of lip toppers in my collection already um, I will go ahead and insert a swatch comparing the Kat Von D Glimmer Veil to the Lime Crime Diamond Crusher. Fantastic so far. I love them. Yeah, I might. There was a really pretty orange color. I think it was called Rocker. One was called Rocker. I really like that one. And then there's like a red and an orange, and I really liked those. Um, yeah, I might just spend some more money on them. Because <laughs> I bought this, guys. This is not sent to me. I wanted this. I bought it and I wanted to show you guys what it looked like. So thank you so much for watching. I'm going to go check out other people's swatches and see what they think of them. But my search for a liquid lipstick that is black and not just matte is finally over and I'm so excited. Thank you Kat Von D for finally coming out with something for that area. Anyways, till next time guys.